Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel and today I'm going to be doing my third cash stuffing of August. So without further ado, let's just get right into it. So starting off with my cash envelopes as usual. So um, I am currently prepping for my vacation, which I am so excited for. Um, I don't know about you guys, but every single time I go on a vacation, I like to make sure when I leave my house is like spotless. So I come back to a completely clean space. Um, it's very relaxing because I know we all have those post vacation blues. So that's what I've, what I've been up to this week. Um, just some rollover from last week. I had $7 left over in food. So I'm gonna put that to the side and we'll put that into my savings challenges later. This envelope is getting a little dirty. I need to clean it. Just don't mind that. All right, uh, food. That is going to be getting $100 and I'm going to be doing 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. That's just going to be five 20s today. I feel like I made this budget a while ago, so um, I might have to make some tweaks here and there in terms of the, the denominations, but we'll see. Next up is stock up, that's getting $5. And I did clean through most of these envelopes, unfortunately, but that's what they're here for. Next up is spending, and that is going to be getting $20. I did decide to give myself a little bit of spending money this week just because I haven't. Um, and honestly, I just want to spend more when I don't have any spending money, which is weird, but just the way my mind works, I don't know why. So I gave myself a little extra there. Next up is house and that's getting, that will be getting $10. I don't know why that was so hard to locate on my spreadsheet. <laughs> Next up is health, and that's going to be getting $30. And I am going to start stuffing health just a little bit more because I um, went to the doctor and I'm currently taking some supplements and those are unfortunately more expensive than I thought they would be. So I am going to have to budget for that accordingly, but health is a priority. So I'm happy to make those allotments where I need to. Where I need to. Next up is nails and that's getting 20. So you may have already there's nothing in here. Um, I already spent my nail money and I'm kind of paying myself back because I did have to get an appointment. I think they're so cute. I got Funny Bunny, just a neutral, something that will match all my outfits. So I am just going to probably take this out and uh, bring it back to the bank. Next up is makeup and makeup's getting nothing this week. And buffers getting nothing this week either. Nothing in bank and I have one receipt. So I'm gonna take uh, this out and put it to the side to scan on my Fetch Rewards and also Receipt Hog. If you guys do not have Fetch Rewards or Receipt Hog, I do have the links down in the bio if you're interested in signing up. Um, I do get some points and you do too. It does change. It's usually between I think two and 4,000 points, which equates to around two to $4. So if you're interested, that will be in the link in my bio. Okay, next up is our sinking funds. Move this to the side. All right, starting off with sinking funds hair. That is going to be getting $100 and that's going to be one 100 today. And I did also get my hair done. Uh, so I am probably just gonna take this out and bring it back to the bank and deposit that into my account. So hair now has one, 150, two, 250, three, 320, 340, and 350. So I'm gonna put it back in there for now, but after this video, I am just gonna take it out, put it to the side, cause it's going back to the bank. Next up is aesthetics. Aesthetics is getting $5 today. And I do have that $500 in the bank already. So we're looking at 510 today. Next up is Christmas and Christmas is of course getting $20 today. And this should be the 500 mark if I'm not mistaken, let's see. 
So Christmas now has 1, 2, 3, 4, 420, 440, 460, 480, 495, 505. Yay! In my next bill swap, I will be sure to swap that out and put a $500 slip there, which is really exciting. All right, next up is going to be gifting. Gifting is getting $10, and I'm going to do 110 here. And gifting, uh, my mom's birthday is coming up and I actually need to go to the store and get her her present and send that over to her because um, she does live far away, so I have to mail it. So I will be using some of this money. So gifting has one, 150, 170, 180, 190, and 200. And I'm happy where that is at right now because realistically after my mom's birthday, I won't have anything until January for my dad's birthday. Uh, because Christmas is separate, of course. All right, next up is car, and car is getting $10. We do have a good bit. It's been building up in car, and I don't drive my car very often because I work from home. So I really don't pull from this that often unless there's going to be a repair that needs to be made or an oil change. So car now has one, two, three, 310, and 320. All right, vacation is going to be the big one this week. So vacation is getting $250 and that's going to be two 100s and 150. And I'm also going, to, oh wow, that, that's split pretty bad. Um, I am going to be taking this out and bringing this to the bank because I am going to, this officially pays off my credit card purchases from my trip, which is exciting. So vacation has one, Two, 253, 354, 420, 440, 460, 485, 520, 540, 560, 580, 6, 620, 640, 650, 660, 670, 680, 697, 710, 720, 730, 740, and 750. Perfect. So we are going to put that to the side because I don't even want to try to put this back in that envelope because it's already so split. So not worth it. I wish there was a way I could fix it. If you guys have any ideas for how to fix this, definitely comment down below and let me know because I don't want to place another order because the shipping is so much. So let me know if you guys are creative with fixing envelopes. All right, next up is luxury and that's not getting anything this week. Business, that is going to be getting $10 this week. Is it just me or does this hundred look funny? I feel like I've not seen one like that in a while. So business now has one, 150, two, 250, 260, 270, and $280 in business. Next up is membership and that's going to be getting $20 this week. And I am going to have to take some of this out to pay off um, a couple of my reoccurring bills that I have, or not bills, excuse me, like subscriptions that I have. So 20, 40, and 50 is in membership right now. I believe I need to take out $30. Next up is house, and that's going to be getting $5. And I believe that is the last one we're stuffing in our sinking fund. So house has $30. <laughs> it's funny because you need so much money for house and I just have 30. But as I said before, you start somewhere. So that's it for my sinking funds. Next up is savings challenges. And we don't have a lot of money to put in there this week. Just $7 plus the $7 that I had for a rollover, but that's okay. Uh, so I'm gonna have to be strategic about this and I don't think I'm going to be able to stuff all of these this week. Um, I believe I'm going to put a total of $4 into my $1 savings challenge. So in that we now have 25, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30, 1, 2. So $32 in the $1 savings challenge. And I'm going to put, this is going to be a tough one. I don't think I'm going to be able to do 52 week this week, unfortunately. Actually, I think I am. And I think I'm just going to do 10. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that'll be the last one that we stuff.
All right, so 52 week now has 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90 dollars which is great we are one tenth tenth of the way there and this 52 week is going towards my my bills i'm going to try and get one month ahead on bills and that's where that money is going to be allocated towards but that is it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed please make sure to hit that subscribe button so you are notified when i publish a new video uh, but thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you next time. Bye!